Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Toast and today we are back with another The City of Final Fantasy Opera Omnia and guys today we're gonna take on Sincere Strength, Cosmos, the level for uh, what's her name? Sync, Sync, and we're jump into it. We're bringing Shiva as our summon because the boss is uh, is weak to uh, ice at the end. So uh, we're gonna bring the boy Noctis because he is almighty powerful right now. We're gonna bring Zack. And we're gonna bring Pain because I am having a lot of fun having Pain in my party. Which is really, really cool. And we're gonna bring a friend Quistus because uh, we do fight a lonely boss at the end, which will make things a lot easier. Uh, am I gonna go with another shooting star? Nah, we're gonna go with Warp Strike. Real, real fast. Get the damage done. Uh, this guy, yeah, he's gonna die faster if I do this. He's gonna die faster if I do this, and uh, my girl, my girl, my girl, my girl. I'll use a break attack. Just cause I can. Just cause I can. These first two waves went by really fast, which is great. So here, let me see. We're gonna go with Warp Strike Plus. Uh... We're gonna go with another chain slash because we should be getting our EX real soon. And right here, I'm gonna do a black sky just for fun, just so we can break A and also do a lot of damage to B. And uh, that was fast. We got the EX, which is perfect. Which is perfect. 14, 14,000 HP damage. I'll take that. Uh, my boy, my boy, my boy. You know what? We're gonna do this. Do a little bit more damage right here. Pain, you should be ge getting, getting, getting your EX real soon. But I think we're gonna go for another break attack. Real fast. Uh, the boy, the boy, the boy. We're gonna go for brave attack here. Hmm. Then I'm gonna go with a shooting star. Get some damage in here. We're gonna do a brave attack. Another brave here. Because we're gonna be able to max out the damage with the characters right now. So we're gonna go with this. And we're gonna go with this. Beautiful! I think we got an EX ready. Is it Pains? Pains? Oh no! Even better. We're gonna go with this. That maybe should kill him. Maybe that should kill him. Yep, it did. And we got Sword Dance, which is perfect. Perfect, perfect, because we're going to be able to maximize the damage on uh, that one single box. Box. Boss. He's not a box. He's a boss. Mm, we're going to go Rush Assault. We are going to reset our skill right here. We're going to launch. Do some brave attacks. Nice and easy. And that target's not broken, right? Right? Oh, we're good for another Apocalypse. Let's do it! Let's do it! Because that thing charges super fast. Uh, do I want to waste one? Yeah, we're just going to go for a regular HP attack. Because we got the 30,000, which was perfect. Another regular HP attack here. The boss should be dying now, though. Uh, you know what? Let's go for one more chain slash. And that should do it. Trusty coffee. Trusty, trusty little coffee. Oh, man, I hate those hymns. Uh, You know what? Let's go with C, just in case I don't kill him. I, I knew this was going to happen. Uh, Alright, let's go kill the bomb. That's going to do it. Um, I'm going to go with a brave attack here. Oh, that's perfect. That is perfect. Perfect turn. All right, this is where we start doing some damage. Now, the cool thing is the boss is by himself. And uh, we're going to try to make him target. Am I going to have my EX? That's the real question. So we're going to do shooting star first. Because I want to have the options 
the option to launch him if I need to. We're gonna break attack. Lower his stats a little bit. Uh, oh, that's gonna be a waste. But it doesn't matter. We're gonna go chain slash. Because I am gonna be getting my EX next turn. We're gonna go for shooting star plus. And that's the beauty of Noctis right here. We're gonna start to be doing some more damage. I'm gonna cast the EX right now. Bam, bam! Zack! Do your thing. I can't wait for this guy to get his level 70 awakening. I seriously can't wait for this guy to get his level 70 awakening. So we have a lot of warp strikes and we're gonna use them. Hey, what is that? Zero? What is that? Zero again! Zero again. We're gonna go Black Sky. Because it's time to uh, cast some destruction on this guy. So my artifacts are still not amazing. Still not amazing on uh, Noctis and uh, Pain. Which I am trying my best to get some good artifacts. But RNG is not on my side on this one. Uh, Alright, time to cast the EX. Beautiful attack. So many hits. Boy, you are one crazy dude. Um, <laughs> chain slash because we're gonna be swapping him eventually we are we are gonna be swapping him eventually for that quest as friends that's pretty good uh warp strike plus it's time to deal some damage noctis it's time to deal some damage my boy do your thing if i would get more attack 108s on this guy it would be amazing uh, let's keep going. Because we have plenty of those moves. Once again, we got Apocalypse ready. I love this attack. I, there's something about Zack that, you know, you just gotta love. So initial, Brave down, attack down, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, he's not here for the damage. He's basically here just to, uh, you know... Make the boss target him the whole time. Do nothing. Uh, we're gonna go with a rush assault. Our attack is lower, but uh, since he's uh, targeting us, we can do a little bit of damage with him real fast. Uh, Noctis. Oh man, this is so good. This is so good. So satisfying. We're gonna go Black Sky. Pain. Deal some damage, girl. Thank you. You know what? We're just going to go for a regular HP attack. Why not? We can do some stuff here. And we got the HP attack plus plus. This is the cool part now. Hey, free warp strikes. How's that? That's pretty amazing. Uh, well, I'm going to be getting Apocalypse next turn, so that should be good. Still nothing. Pull up. Just a little bit of damage. But that doesn't matter. We're gonna go for one more break attack here. Not so bad. Uh, you know what? I want to keep my EX for the summon. So I'm just gonna go for a regular HP attack plus plus. That's pretty good. Uh, you know what? We can... Uh, we can do this. We can do this. Because I can maximize his damage here. So we're going to try this. We're going to try this. The first time I did this, I basically used Quistus in the summon. But I'm going to try using Zack in the summon. See if we can maximize the damage. Let's see. Let's see what this does. Let's see what this does. If we can maximize the amount of damage. Now, the real thing is Noctis. How much can you get up to? Can you get to the 55,000 as it's lagging a little bit? The damage is also, it's insane. That's why. Uh, you know what? I'm going to be using her now. So she's going to be able to fuel my party with damage. This is crazy. This is really good. We're going to go with Black Sky. Damn boy. Damn boy. Uh, let's go with the regular HP attack, plus plus. 
because we're going to be able to do a lot of damage here. Oh, another degenerate whip. Push that boss back. And we got some launch. Well, we're just going to go for the HP attack. It's pretty good. All right, Pain. Pain, do your thing, girl. We're going to go for another break attack here. That's not bad at all. Uh, we're going to go for shooting star. That's good. Push the boss back a little bit more. Now let's use the black sky. I'm telling you guys, this is probably one of the easiest versions of uh, of Cosmos. Since you're only fighting one boss, this is pretty easy. Ooh, baby, this is gonna be good. This is gonna be good. Because that launch option can do a lot of damage, which is great. We're gonna go for Oming Whip. Yeah, girl. Alright, since he's debuffed, let's see if uh, we can use this a little bit faster. Go, girl. Do your sword dance as I'm drinking my coffee. I like that. Uh, just in case, I'm just going to go for a regular whip attack. Because, uh, there you go. Alright, so Zack's coming in after. And we got this ready. Damn, this is going really, really well. I think this is gonna go better than my initial run. Because I'm taking... Basically, in my first run, I think I took like three times HP damage. Which hopefully right now I'm not gonna be jinxing it. Uh, now, the real question is, can I still survive that? You know what? We're just gonna go for a regular brave attack. Well, that doesn't matter. He's gonna do a little bit of HP. Nope, magic bullets. That's good. All right, so let's try to kill him before he does another another HP attack. Never mind, he did an HP attack. Never mind. Uh, we're good with the break attack. Now he did boost himself up, right? Uh, hello, boss. All right, he just has attack up and speed up, which doesn't really matter for me. Uh, we're gonna keep going with this. I think that's the correct way to do things real fast. We're gonna go with Rush Assault. Pain, girl. Where you at, Pain? Where you at, Pain? Please, boss, don't do anything crazy. Just keep doing giant punches. A little bit more HP damage, doesn't matter. We're gonna be good with that. We're gonna go with Chain Slash. Now we should be able to kill him this turn. Should be. Oh yeah, that's gonna do it. As I'm putting the phone down, that should do it. Oh, are you serious? Alright, Pain. You finished the job. Pain girl, finish the job. I gotta say, this team is really, really fun to run. And this boss was uh, really easy. Seriously, I did not expect a Cosmo level to be that easy. Especially after the Porom event. Those three bosses were so annoying. And we did beat our previous score. I'm sure you guys can do a better score than that. Obviously, this is nothing crazy. But uh, yeah, maybe I want to go in with a different team and uh, try to run it without a tank. Maybe I'll try that, running without a tank and just bring some physical damage dealers and try to beat that boss up. So guys, like always, let me know down below which team did you use, who was your support, and uh, yeah, how well did it go for you guys. On this note, thank you so much for watching this video. Please leave a like down below, subscribe for more, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.